Fez is known for its marinid architecture and vibrant souks. And now centuries-old places of learning are making a comeback. Quranic schools or madrasas flourished in the Moroccan city at the height of Islamic civilization during the 13th and 14th centuries. Here, medicine, mechanics and music were also taught alongside the Islamic sciences. Their ornate doors and gates make attractive backdrops for photos. But tour guide Sabah Aloui says many visitors are seeking more than that, a strong historical connection to the old city, which these madrasas provide. The Quranic schools are important in the tourist circuit because they contributed to the city's fame during the Marinid dynasty in the 4th century. So of course we have to visit the madrasas, either Buenania or even the Sirhij school in the Andalus quarter. But this one is close to the Bab Bujalud gate because that's where the visit starts. Here there are two parts, in the new city and here in the Medina. In the new town, it's really modern. It's a young town, a new town. But here, it's really traditional, it's really attractive. Qarawiyan University is widely considered to be the world's oldest, dating as far back as the 9th century. It hosted noted scholars such as Ibn Khaldun, the founding father of sociology, and Jaber of Oriyak, a polymath who introduced Arabic numerals to Europe. Its library houses some of the rarest manuscripts in the world and recently underwent restoration. Every time intellectuals edited a new work or a book, the original copy was offered as a gift to the Qarawin library. So this library has been a place to protect the author's rights. Every time we flip through a manuscript, it allows us to discover a priceless legacy left by its authors. The institution is also looking to the future preparing the next generation of scholars who can continue the city's intellectual history. It started a new comparative religion program for students who have memorized the Qur'an, helping them gain insight into other cultures through Hebrew and English texts, a fitting tribute to a city and a school with such vibrant intellectual traditions. Adam Amunu, TRT World.